Hey chat fam, I'm going to be a little quiet right now because everyone is asleep. But today, right now, is actually a super, super special day. Today is Kara's birthday. So my sweetheart turns 31 today. She doesn't like hearing that. That's how old I am, so that's okay. But you guys go and leave some love for Kara in the comments. Leave her a nice message. I'm gonna have her go through and read all of them. But today's vlog is actually super special. One, I kind of made it for her. So I made it for Kara because I know that she likes going back and she's watched our birth vlog like 20 times just because she loves reminiscing when the triplets are born. This vlog is gonna go back to when we found out about the triplets, the whole pregnancy, everything I had filmed. So I had to go through a lot of footage, so it took a while. Growing belly, and then all the way till the triplet birth while they were in the NICU for the 20 days, all the times we went and visited them and their whole progress, and then finally to when we get to bring them home. So this is the triplet birth, the movie. So this is the first chat fam movie. So this vlog is a little longer than the rest, but hey, this is a movie. So go get some popcorn, you know, we all have a lot of time to kill. Sit down and enjoy. A little throwback to when we found out Kara was pregnant with triplets. Kara, happy birthday, babe. I love you so much. You've given me the world and there's no words to express how much you mean to me, but I love you and I can't wait for what's next. And I hope you enjoy the movie. What's up guys? We are the Chatwins and this is our very first entry level vlog. Um, that is Gemma. Come here, sweet this girl. This is Gemma. Say hi everybody. Can you say hi? I'm Derek. This is my beautiful wife Kara and this is our daughter Gemma who's one and a half. I took my pregnancy test. Positive. I was so excited. They told me that I was having one baby so it was good but it was really small. So I needed to come back the next week. I go by myself with Gemma because I'm in the clear. And that's when they found three babies. Like not one, <laughs> not twins, not two, three. Three babies. Who has three? <laughs> yeah. Three. Hey. Who's a cute girl? You's a cute girl. You's a cute mama. It was a cute mama and a cute girl. Come on. <laughs> We're Jenner. matching. <laughs> Are you rubbing your mama's belly? <laughs> oh yeah, you rubbing. This is where you have to rub your mommy's belly. Put the lotion on her. Can you put the lotion on mama's belly? Can you put it on mama? Are you sleepy? <laughs> Gemma? Gemma, that is a lot of body butter. Can you put it on Mama's tummy for the babies? Kayla looking so pretty. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. A bubble. A bubble. A bubble. Look at that baby. Look at that. Look at those babies. Oh, oh it's really soft. <laughs> Here at Alpine Lube, ready for some photo shoot. Looking tasty. Back in the woods. Baby got friends. Baby. Okay. Gemma. Look how pretty you are. You're a pretty girl. Do you love the mountains? I like uh um.
I have the most beautiful family in the world. We're gonna walk to a special little spot. There's a special spot up here. I'm gonna show you guys. It's really special, huh, Gemma? Spot right here. That's it. This is the spot right here where I proposed to Kara. Yes. And then we kissed. And then we had triplets and Gemma. I'll go. I'll go. Yeah? I'll go. Okay. I promise to always be the best husband, father best friend and dad to all of your kids even if you have oh, 10 more oh we lost one we have one child and we it's still lose her uh oh I get. you're looking at the water whoa whoa Go back, go back. Yo, what? Whoa. Fun. Are you taken? <laughs> no. Three babies reside in here. <laughs> Three. Oh, How? How? Is that fine? Go, go follow your sister. Ray, Ray, Ray. <laughs> Dude, they're so cute. I don't understand how this three days this doesn't make sense. This right? Doesn't Bro, trust, trust me. It's not a reality gonna, yet. You guys are gonna freak hey. out. Hey! Oh, yeah. no. Family! Hi, cuties. They tell us of Christ, flesh, and blood. He gave because he Gemma. cares. Gemma, I hate to interrupt, Gemma. but can you say goodnight, please? Say night night. Night night. Oh, sweet girl, I love you. Cute shirt, Kara. What does it say? Mom life. Uh, you're a mom? No. <laughs> what are you doing? Man, I have to go put her to bed. Hi. 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 Do a dance, dance, dance. What? Ooh, I can see your belly button. I can't really read your Adidas because it says like, da da da. Everything kind of fits still. Does she look pretty? Do you want to give her a kiss with her new lipstick? Do you want to give me a kiss? Me or Mama? Gemma, you're supposed to give us a kiss. Kiss. Gemma, I want you to kiss me. Mm. Okay. Mwah. 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 All in the middle, all in the middle. One, two, three, go. Gemma, join us. Kiss us. Mwah. The boy is going to have my middle name, Hunter. That will be the boy's middle name. For the girls, the middle name will be... I don't know. At least one of them will be. I don't know. What? Marie. Hers is Marie. But one of the girls has to be Marie. So you want to have two girls with the middle name Marie and one girl that just doesn't get it? Yeah! We're going to use it. Because <laughs> great women have Marie that middle name. Marie is prettier than Hunter. What is this? What is this? Kara? What is this stuff? Hey, you look good. Thank you. Kara, what is that? And what is that? It's for my baby shower that I finally get to have. I'm so excited. Yeah, did you get your makeup done too? <laughs> he is excited too. 
Hey, babe, you look good. Thank you. You gonna go like that? Yeah. Okay. My dress is really pretty. I'll show you in a second. Just got my makeup done. Got all of our treats. <laughs> Hold on, I'm just getting a quick shot of the trips. I can see them. They're kicking. <laughs> well, run along now. You better hurry. Go get ready, bud. I know, I have to get. Hey, babe, do you want to see a magic trick? Yeah. Okay, go and stand against that wall right there. Real quick, hurry, 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 hurry. Stand against that wall. All right, have you ever seen real magic before? I don't know. All right, ready? Abracadabra, one, two, three. Cut a babe, do a spin for me, spin! What? That is a magic trick, I told you. Babe. Magical. Babe. How did I do it? All right, hey, you going to your little baby shower? Yes. Good, you look great, fantastic. I love all three of you. All right, <laughs> here, take this little thingy. Make sure you film a lot, have Let's fun. Let's go. He's going to set up for me. And so last time that we had this shower styled shoot planned was the day I went into preterm labor. I mean, I'm glad that we kept the babies in, kept them safe, but it was really sad because I was so excited and I have so many people helping with it. I'm just really relieved we get to do it again. Here we go. Just helping these girls set up for this beautiful baby shower. We got Ashley, got Kara babe, Harley babe, both pregnant. All right, babe, you gonna manage without me? No. Bye. Well, you can't leave yet. I gotta go. All the tables. Oh, okay. We're getting everything set up for the baby shower. It's about to start. It looks so beautiful. This greenhouse is amazing. Potted pansy, did all the florals. Look at this dream boat. He just helped set up the whole shower. Where is Blake? This is Blake. Hello. If you don't know him, hire him for a shoot and he'll become your BFF. True. He's the best. Love her. So excited to be here. Don't have those babies while I'm gone. No males allowed. Here you go, princess. See ya. Bye. Say hello to the trips. We're about to open gifts. Hello. And look at those two cuties up there. You'll see the good pictures from them later. Oh. 
There we go. Right there is perfect. <laughs> that was awesome. I like that. <laughs> it's a wrap. Can I see your new boots? Where are they? Do you love them? Gemma, they're so pretty. They're shiny black. Seven, eight. <laughs> we have nine, babe. Here's a girl. Let's see. Baby sees a girl. Oh, so cute. That's a boy. The boy is right here. That's crazy. They can get images that clear. Look at this. Crazy. Thing. Look at that's like a real little face. Baby A wouldn't really take her photo off. You can see that belly. Sweet loafers. <laughs> Whoa. Big belly. <laughs> that is a big belly. Hi, how are you? <laughs> Doing good, just looking okay, at her bye. belly. We just got a few more pictures from the doctor. She checked everything out and they're all looking healthy and great and growing and they're like over 50th percentile for a single baby. So they're doing really well. They're all about three pounds lower end of the threes, which was my goal. Yes. Now we're gonna go downstairs to my second doctor's appointment for blood pressure, weight, heartbeat, even though we just did that, but yay. I'm so excited, they're getting big. Now we're going to doctor appointment number two. More to check on me, blood pressure, weight, Make sure everything's looking good. Make sure you're looking good. Make oh, sure I I'm checked. Looking good. You are. <laughs> Let's go, you baby <laughs> mama trauma baba. I'm just a birthing unit. I know you are. <laughs> oh, jeez. What does that mean? So not too bad. That's good. Is it high? Uh, no. Anything uh, below 120 is okay. Yeah. Your shoes. Ready? He'll be in in a few minutes, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Here's what we need to do. We need to convince Dr. Broberg to deliver my babies. Be on special call for me because that's who I want to deliver my babies. As opposed to who? Anyone else. There's well, like eight people in the group. Let's convince them, Kara. <laughs> so you don't get to choose your doctor, but this one that's going to come in. We'll get a little sneak peek of him. She really likes him. And we're gonna try to convince him <laughs> to do it. I like some of the other ones, but I've only met like half of the whole team. I don't want some stranger cutting me open and pulling my babies out. It's an ultrasound. Instead of the non-stress test, which we usually do, with triplets, it, that gets to just be this Yeah, we did thing. it in the hospital. Oh, yes, it was, They were yes. like checking each baby yes. and it was it hard to, to be crazy. hold it on. <laughs> I want you to deliver them. Well, I would love that. Um, <laughs> but I know it's a little This is your favorite doctor, you. by the way. <laughs> are we live? Oh, my God. oh sorry. No, we're not <laughs> live. We're not live. <laughs> um, I'll, I'll make you look good, don't worry. Okay, good, good. If you could doctor things. But she said that you're her like, favorite doctor. Like, what day doctor. do I need oh, to go into really labor? Sweet. How does it work? With you, it's going to be a little tricky because I have a feeling, well, it may not. Maybe we're going to have things scheduled, which right. is very convenient, and that would be great. Um, but it, you, I probably won't make it You're probably going to have your bag of water break, or you go into labor, and it's going to be who's here, and that's what we should do. 28 weeks is like, I'll feel better. 30? Good. Yeah. And then 32. 32 is great. almost like your turn. <laughs> yeah. As far as outcomes, long-term outcomes. And I, when I was there, I was like, that's 30. It's like six weeks so away. I'll never make away. it that far. No, but it went really fast. The other thing, how about contractions? Are you feeling I the time? Are you I haven't quiet? even felt like Braxton Hicks this time. <laughs> Doing good, Kara. 
Thank you. You really are doing good. <laughs> Almost 30 weeks. You should be at the hospital. Make sure you're there. I'm going to try to be there all the time. I'm just going to go into labor when I know he's working. Oh, everyone will, everyone will be arm wrestling trying to get to your delivery. It's going to be so exciting. Maybe. Yeah, there's scary. not a lot of these going on. No, it's, you know, we see them, but not like twins. I'm a twin. We're common. Are you really? I'm a twin. Yeah, identical. Identical? Yeah, I'm just a little better looking, a little stronger. <laughs> All of that smarter. Okay. Yeah, I know how that goes. Yeah. He actually has me in everything, except for babies. <laughs> when you guys are famous here, like they all knew who we were going through. Yeah. They're like... It's, it's like the only triplet slavery. family they've yeah. had for a long time. Is that, oh, wow. Yeah. They said awesome. there's been five triplets since the NICU opened. And it's been on 20 years or something. Yeah. We're happy to see you every week. If you feel more comfortable, you could do it the same day you go in for the biophysical profile. Good to see you guys again. Good to see you. Yeah, babies are healthy. Babies are healthy. Mama's healthy. <laughs> Is that your pregnant happy dance? Yes. All right. I have to pee. I'm sorry. I'll race you to the car. Where did you park? Do you want to race? <laughs> Where did you park? I'll even give you a head start. I don't start. even know where the car is. Yeah, that's the problem. You don't know where it is. And I'll give you a head start. Okay. Okay, go. Okay, I'm kidding. Stop. <laughs> Maybe we could go to Cubbies. Ooh, Cubbies. Mmm. Do you want to go there? Okay. We're going to have a dance off? <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm excited for this. But I'm wearing this. a sports bra. Okay. With my belly out. All right, I'm down. Let's see. We'll do it. Tonight? All right. The babies are going to come out. Gemma, who won? Mama or Dada? Oh, mama. I think she just said Mama. Did you say Mama? Hey, did you say Mama or Dada? Dada. Yes! These triplets are going to come very soon. Mm -hmm. Especially after that dance off. Mwah! Mwah! I heard him talk. Like, subscribe, comment. X O. The triplets. The triplet challenge. Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. I love you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What? Oh, shit. <laughs> I got something important. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Gemma and Jade, do you guys want to go to the farm? Yeah. Let's go, come on, let's go to the farm. Pia, you want to go to the farm? Let's go, Don't come on. Don't say that to her. We're taking everybody. <laughs> it's a pregnant mom day at the farm with babies and dogs. <laughs> you want to take care? We made it to the pumpkin patch with these cute girls. Gemmers. <laughs> Hey, where are you little cats going? <laughs> uh oh. 
In the next two weeks, you guys, we're going to have three babies. In the next two weeks. Sometime it can be tomorrow, it can be right now. She could be in there giving birth right now. Oh, I think I'm going into labor. That's not funny. <laughs> Come here, give me daddy hug. Big mama's going into labor. <laughs> When the song come on, let me see you get gone. Get gone. Baby mamas, this your song. Been pregnant for way too long. Too long. Now tell the DJ, turn it off. Turn it off. If she a baby mama, she gon' do that baby mama. Work. She gon' put it on you. Uh -huh. She gon' do that baby mama. Drop, 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 one month, two month, three month, four. Hit the baby mama when I'm stepping through the door. Yeah, I'm pregnant, but I got an ill flow. Trying to make some money, buy some huggies from the stove. S to the T A, double R K to the E I S H A. And I don't play, doing my way. Prego, but I'm still doing moves like Beyonce. Yeah, I said I'm pregnant, pregnant. Get the child support and pay my rent, pay my rent. Your opinion is irrelevant, irrelevant. Cause I'm a baby mama, I can do just what I wanna turn up. If she a baby mama, uh, she gon' do that baby mama. Work. She gon' put it on you. Uh -huh. She gon' do that baby mama. Drop, 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 Baby bottle, I need a baby bottle. Baby daddy broke, better hope he hit the lotto. Yeah, my belly big, but I'm looking like a model. See me in the club and I'm going full throttle. Twerk right, twerk left. Take a break, cause I'm out of breath. Finally dancing with her baby bump. When the song come on, let me see you get gone. Kara Chatwin is ready to pop with triplets. So she does the baby mama dance to induce birth. Yeah, I'm pregnant, but I got an ill flow. Her husband Derek joins in. She don't do that baby mom. And so does their daughter Gemma. Drop, 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 drop. Down, 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 down. No luck yet. <laughs> but hopefully soon. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Hey. <laughs> Uh, hey, can you zip up your shirt? We're wearing matching clothes. Yeah. There you go. We're ready to go. Da da da. Da da da. My big baby. What the heck? <laughs> Derek. Gemma. That is Gemma. not a toy. Hey. <laughs> You're Gemma, crazy. That thing's not a toy. She's <laughs> not a step. She's just stepping on her belly. <laughs> One baby, two baby, three baby. Is it all zipped? Ready to go? Yep, it's all zipped. Just give me a lovey, lovey's. Oh, oh. So hard to leave the house because you just want to play and jump and play and jump, huh? That's all you want to do. You're so fast. You're a track star. Hey, can you put your shoes on? Hey. You need help? Um. I keep spilling it on my belly. <laughs> I seriously had a contraction <laughs> while we were eating. So, if the babies come tonight, we know why. Gemma, are you ready to go? You look so cute. Are you a kitty cat? I'm up. I'm up. You jumped. <laughs> we got your wagon. Ready to go? So, are you ready to go? Aww. You so excited? Oh, you're dancing? You excited? Let's go. Mama's gonna push you. Oh, hey, Kara, you're supposed to be on bed rest. What bed rest? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. Take that basketball oh, out. This is more than a basketball. Yeah, it is. It's like four bowling balls. <laughs> okay, let's go, Gemma. Where are we going first? Pretzel. <laughs> Pretzel for this girl. Who are you riding with? I said you can't hang out with boys yet. <laughs> Gemma, who's that? <laughs> Who is it? Who is he? It's a guy. It's a guy. 
you love him? Carrie, get in there with her. <laughs> yeah, right. Jump in, come on. Do you love him? Is he cute? You stay away from my daughter, you hear me? I took care of it, Gemma. You're crazy, girl. <laughs> hey, Kara. It's about time you get in that cart. Want to jump in? Yeah. All right, go. Can I sit with you? Oh, look at you guys. I Gemma, you having fun? Look <laughs> at that big mama in the mall. Where are the babies? Oh, baby. Oh. Yeah. No, don't show everyone the babies. Huh? Don't show everyone the babies. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, no. No. Hide the babies. Yeah. Just getting my stroll oh, on through Abby. the mall. Go, go. Oh. Abby. Yeah. Uh, go, go. We have our man servant. Yeah, I'm just the nanny. The manny. <laughs> the manny. Isn't this fun? That we can fit. Both you and the Whoa, she's crazy. Please take me to Zara. Where? Zara. Girl, who do you think I am? I'm not your slave. My man slave. We have a budget. $20. You can spend it wherever you want. $20 will get Gemma a hair bow. Gemma, where's your cat ears? Why? Why are you climbing like that? Your mama needs to get out. It's uncomfortable. Will you give her a hug? Will you give her a hug? <laughs> what are you doing, you crazy animal? Ready to go? Ow! What the heck? <laughs> what the heck? Oh! Mama, mama! Yeah, you jumped on my tummy. Oh no. I know, Gemma, that's cavities. Yuck. Oh, honey. If you don't turn it, you're gonna hit it. Oh, good girl, you turned it. Good job. Go right, you're gonna hit somebody. Careful. Sorry. She got rolled. I know. Oh, careful, Gemma, careful. Sorry. <laughs> Here you go, girlfriend. Ooh, big mama. Big mama. Oh, that fits you well, girl. <laughs> Can you button it up? It'll, <laughs> it'll fit me someday. <laughs> someday. Keep going. Ooh. I'm gonna get some paper towels. Oh. Come on, can you pick out what picture you want? Oh. Whoa, look at it. <laughs> look at yeah. Oh, wow, your pumpkin looks so good. How'd you get it so gutted? Mama. Mama helped you? <laughs> Cheater. You're supposed to be baked. Can you say spooky? Oh, boo, hubby. Spooky. That was nice. Let's go see who won. Let's go see who won. Just for the sake that Kara is carrying three babies, we'll let her win. Kara, you win. Apple, apple, ah, ah, ah. Can you say it? Apple, ah, ah, Oh, that's close. <laughs> All right, you ready to go? Yes. Kara, you look like a gorgeous pregnant mom of four. Less than two weeks, we're gonna have three more little Skeletors. We really haven't had this channel up too long. Your guys' love has been like overwhelming, but this is literally happening right now. We never imagined getting to 100,000 this quickly, and we can't thank you guys enough, it's insane. 
Gemma's thanking you guys back there. Gemma says, here. thank you, everybody. Keep on smiling. Do good to others. Be, Be kind. kind. Be and kind. So grateful Mommy. to bring three more babies into this world because they're going to be so much fun and so crazy and so fun. <laughs> so crazy and so fun. Be baby, baby. Do you want to go outside? Can you say please, Dada? Can you say I love you, Dada? Can you say thank you, Dada? From everyone that voted in the comments, the winner is Kara. I lost. I died. So you and your two sisters are going to be treated so special. So usually guys, I go to the doctor's appointments with Kara. Today, we sent her by herself, mainly because Gemma kind of gets crazy in there and runs around and tries pressing all the buttons and touching everything. Thank you so much for all the prayers. We've heard from a lot of you that you guys are continually praying for the triplets and it means a lot to us. It really does, thank you. Yo, Gemma, I love you, Gemma. Did the UPS guy come and bring you mail? Are you excited to go open your mail? Mom just got home from the doctor's appointment. Give us an update, a bump date. So I'm almost 34 weeks now, in a couple days. Baby A, four pounds, 11 ounces. B and C are both four pounds, 15 ounces, so almost five pounds. By next week when I have my C-section, if we make it that far, they'll all be like over five pounds, which is amazing for triplets. And then with my fluid and placentas, that's another 15 pounds in my stomach. So there's 30 pounds going on right here. So Kara, I weighed Gemma yesterday and it was like 26.5 pounds. You have more than Gemma in there. Basically, I have a big baby Gemma. It's like Gemma just crawled in, curled up under your shirt, <laughs> and you have to carry her around for like, oh, all day long. Girl, let's get you sitting down. Please, my back is killing me. All right, but sorry, we're going to the pumpkin patch. Do you see the big spider? Oh, oh I Feels so good to be alone. Oh, we're gonna be alone never again, the rest of our lives. We're not alone, actually. <sighs> Gemma, this is scary. <laughs> Gemma, that was so fun. Scary. <laughs> <laughs> is that for you? Thank you for being a part of the Chatwin family. We really appreciate you. We really do love you guys so, so much. Can you say, love you? Say, mwah. Oh, I love you, Gemma. Mwah. Question that we get asked the most is, was it natural or? The most asked question is, did you do in vitro? Which we did not do in vitro. We didn't do IUI. We didn't have any shots, but I did take this pill. I took the same one with Gemma, and you take it and it helps you ovulate. The one that I took is Letrozole. It's like Clomid, Famara, Letrozole. They're all the same thing. So it just helps you like drop an egg, ovulate. Um, it's less than a 1% chance of having triplet. Crazy odds yeah. that we even got pregnant with triplets. Was your initial reaction to triplets? 
<laughs> so I called him. That's when I just cried and cried and cried. I remember I was driving on the freeway in a rental car <laughs> in a different state, and then she just said, Derek, there's three. And he I, made me say it like 10 times. I was like, nope, no, there's not. <laughs> Kara, no, there is not. And I pulled over and I just like, side of the freeway. <laughs> I don't even know if I pulled over all the way. I think I was like in the middle of the traffic. I was like, there is not three. So shock, it took about two weeks for me to like settle it in. I remember going to my twin brother, sobbed into his shoulder and he, <laughs> he was as well. What's going on, Derek? Uh, and I cried for like two weeks straight. Shock factor, but now that it's processed, of course you would not have it any other way. I'm excited to have a big family. Like Christmas morning when they're all running down the stairs and like so excited to see what Santa brought. I'm nervous for, I don't know, when my daughters are to the point where they like boys. Yeah. Oh, that's going to be horrible. We love you guys. Thanks for all the prayers. We really do appreciate it. Until next time. XO. Little baby turbans. They're so small and cute. Gemma wore these all the time, so I know these babies will be. <laughs> yeah, I just rest them all right, there, right on that landing. Look at this. Oh. Oh no. Something just happened. No, do not. Is, now is not the time, girl. <laughs> that really hurts. We have a scheduled date. It is not right now. My mom's we are going not to go here yet. I can't. Food, okay. Please don't have the babies right now. Huh. You good? So. Are the babies staying in? Yeah. <laughs> Last but not least. Wow. Okay. Let's talk bump. You guys might want to say goodbye to this baby. Let's all take a moment of silence. <laughs> Any memories you've had with this bump? Anything you want to like leave on the table? Any last words? Any words of advice? Any final departures of the bump? <laughs> Just make sure you leave them right here. We're going to do a moment of silence real quick for the bump. Yeah, I said moment of silence. <laughs> I like being pregnant. I really do. I love being pregnant with Gemma. I liked most of this pregnancy, but it's just gotten to the point where I will not miss this thing anymore. It's too big, too heavy. I've done my job. Actually, Kara, the one thing that I will miss is that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I think that's a sign. That is a sign that it's, it's not over. working out anymore. It's over. <laughs> it's Let's over. extract the treasure from this thing. This is like a treasure chest. Inside <laughs> is the most beautiful treasure you've ever seen. So we got inspired by your question of the nursery tour. And a couple days ago, we went and bought ribs and mattresses. We bought a shelf. We're gonna set up the dresser and we will actually have a nursery. Triplets. Coming soon. <laughs> like how soon? Couple days. And thank you for all of your name suggestions. We actually are using one that we found in the comments. He said it out loud and I said, oh, I actually really like that. That's what we're using. We're using it. YouTube has actually named, named one, of our babies. one of our kids. We love you guys. You guys are actually a part of like family now. Pretty much you named our kids. <laughs> you should move in. Can I have a kiss? Oh, you're so cute. Yeah, so you still know that I'm dad now, right? Hey, we're gonna do our own house first. Ready? Good job. Okay, what do you say? Say trick or treat. Okay, oh. candy. This is what a triplet mom does on Halloween, right here. I write back to you guys. Heart your comments. Look at oh. Read your comments. She's looking at it. this girl. We're is going through and responding going to through. everyone. Good job, Kara. Oh, here I want to do one. I'm wearing her shirt right now. Oh, the babies. Oh, oh the babies. Oh, the babies. Oh. <laughs> she face. does not want you to hold her. She does not know who I am. Oh, is he scary? Oh, oh the babies. Go oh, see babies. Dada. <laughs> <Shut up. laughs>
She's oh, not here. Tim, this is your first Halloween dressing up, huh? And having fun, actually. <laughs> oh, yeah? Ooh, 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 ooh. Say night night. Night night, guys. Yeah, do a spin. That was a good spin. <laughs> Happy Halloween, guys. We love you. Happy Halloween. This actually is going to be the last time that you're going to see Kara's bump. It really, really is. It is currently Tuesday night. We decided that we're going to do a belly plast for you guys. We had a lot of requests. I went and bought some plaster and we're going to plaster Kara's belly. So we actually have a memory of how big that thing was and how beautiful it was. So it's Tuesday night, tomorrow, Wednesday, November 7th, three angels are coming into this world. We actually go to the hospital at 5 a.m. 5 a.m. Like no one should be awake at that hour. We head to the hospital at 5 a.m. and her C-section will be at 7 a.m. So when you guys watch this video on Thursday, the triplets are already gonna be here. They are here. The triplets are here, you guys. Easy form. Let's see how easy you really are. Hey, you beautiful mama. How are you? Great. How are you feeling? Nervous. I just told our chat fam that we go in tomorrow at 5 a.m. So now everyone knows. <laughs> Except by the time they watch this, they're gonna be here. But tomorrow at 5 a.m., babe, we go into the hospital. C-section is at seven. We love you. <laughs> I love you more than anything, but I love you, you, and you. And I can't wait to meet you guys. And I know your names already. Mmm, beautiful names. Can't wait to show you guys what the names are. What are your thoughts? Final thoughts. Nervous for the C-section, but Stoked to meet the babies and to see what they look like to not be pregnant anymore. You mean you can't wait to not be pregnant anymore? No, I have I'll... shin splints right now from standing. Man, like, I'm sorry. My shins are killing me and I have not done anything today. I've just stood. Kara, you've rocked pregnancy. You really have. During tape, we'll see how big this baby really is. All right, we got it. Okay. The right. answer has been locked in. What do we have? 43 inches. No way. This is 43. Kara. You couldn't even fit one baby in there. That, yeah. What's good? Yeah, how do you fit three babies in that? That looks like it could fit like a foot. It, that could fit Gemma's foot. <laughs> All right, you guys, here goes. I'm leading my wife to the chair to get plastered. Oh, it's all powdery. Whoa. It's very powdery. Eat a bowl. Gotta put some warm water in it. And it just says cut strips as needed. This is the length that we decided. We measured, we'll actually go all around her belly and almost to like her back. Ready? Yep. Okay. This is my wife, Kara, AKA Cleopatra the mummy. We're looking good so far. Actually, we're doing pretty good. Just a little husband and wife craft night. This is crazy. Oh my gosh, the babies are moving. Whoa, oh my gosh. They, they're they trying to come out. Oh my gosh, hold on. Yeah, I this is hard, rock though. solid. You can't really see them even moving anymore because it's so hard. But I can feel it. Dude, this is fun. This is what I need. This is way more fun than I thought. This is what I've needed this whole pregnancy to like hold my belly. I know. You, you could have wrapped it. it around my back and it would hold the weight up. Last strip. <laughs> Done, baby. Time to let it dry. Picked her out of the coffin. It's Queen Carapatra. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this should have been my Halloween costume. What are you most excited for about tomorrow? I'm excited to see what they look like. Just to see like how much they weigh, like how their breathing and everything is, because I've been so curious. When you're expecting triplets, you just think of like all the scary stories of when they're born super early and how tiny they are. And I'm excited just to see like how big they are. It's kind of tight around my Whoa. Back. <gasps> I don't know if we did it big enough. It looks like a motorcycle helmet. That is how far. It like sticks out. Wow. It's so crazy that like seriously off of my body, it just goes like, <laughs> that's like yeah, so like That is your out. stomach and then that's how much it protrudes. Okay, ready? Let's see how it looks on me. Oh, the babies. Oh, oh. my gosh. 
that oh. angle. Yeah, how do you do it? Like, this is actually kind of heavy, too. That is nothing. Yeah, and there's no babies in it. There's no fluids. There's nothing. I kind of feel cool, like I'm holding an artifact. Say goodbye. Seriously. Say goodbye. Suite. <laughs> Are you ready? As ready as I'll ever be. <laughs> and that's where they're definitely missing two more of these machines. <laughs> we need two more of those. This is it. Final countdown. In T minus two hours, three more chat ones will be here. <laughs> we'll be a family of six. You got this, Kara. Here, don't record this. I'm not. Just rocking away. Waiting for this girl to get prepped for her C-section in this really comfortable rocking chair. Hospital grade. <laughs> Hi. Oh, good morning. Oh, oh hey. <laughs> I don't know how. Uh... This is an alcoholic shot, apparently, to help her relax. How's that feel? So this is the pre-operating room. Before we go to the operating room, so Kara's just getting her IV right here, just getting all prepped up. We got Ashley over here, just taking care of my beautiful wife. Thank you, yes, Ashley. You're, you're welcome. the best. And Kara's just looking beautiful, and she's ready to have some children. <laughs> my litter. You'll do good. You will. Most people get more freaked out ahead of time. I'll meet you back there. Okay. Hey, Kara, you look great. So the problem we're having is Kara is so loyal to me that she hasn't taken her ring off in how many years? Probably five. <laughs> five years. We cannot get her wedding ring off. Like legit, we use KY jelly, lotion. It's not coming off. I have an IV in right now, so I'm kind of like fluid. So I'm yeah, a little swollen, but hopefully we can get this ring off because you can't have it in the operating room. A good maybe twirl. Ow, my no. knuckle is like It's just so too big. big. We can't get her ring off. All that energy. Yeah, but I think off. we just leave it on rather than cut it off. <laughs> you heard the doctor. Owie. You're the only girl that's going with her wedding ring in. <laughs> Good yeah. job. Are you ready? We'll stay married throughout scared? the procedure. Yeah. Don't you be scared. It's just going to be a party. It's going to be really fun. You're going to be comfortable. And then you're going to hear some crying. And it's going to be really cool. It's going to be so fun. Love it. You got this. I'm so excited for you. This is going to be fun. I think we're about we're ready. ready. We're ready. So, yeah. Kara, are you ready? Way as possible. Yeah. I'm not. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, we'll see you back there in a set. You ready? Mm. We're going to scooch off this bed. Kara. All right. Let's go guys, let's go deliver some babies. I'm pretty nervous. The doctor getting all washed up. Oh, I'm gonna have to do that too. Yes, you will. super super smooth and we couldn't be more happy thank you they did amazing the 
Babies are born. They are healthy. Royal Reese and Ren are here and they're healthy and we're gonna go see them right now. They're in their little incubator. 30 minutes start to finish. These doctors are amazing. Good work. Thank you so much. So, so much. You guys are amazing. Babies are here. Look here, that, that wasn't hard. Wanna do it again? You want your big blanket on? That was quick. So you have to wash in the elbow, your hand, for five minutes. And there's my timer. I feel like I've been here for an hour and it's been three minutes. So that's good though. Bring any germs in here. Hi, Ren. Hey. Where's your pinky? There you go, sweet girl. Sweet girl. Ren, I love you. Reese, you're doing so good. You came out first. You were the first one to come out. Baby Reese was delivered by Dr. Reese. So that was kind of cool. And she has a lot of hair. A lot. A lot more than Gemma had. Oh. Sweet girl. I love you. Hi, Royal. You're doing so good. It's long fingers, Royal. Ooh, you're so strong already. Daddy's got calluses. Reese's first little bath. We'll just start with her little hands. Good night, Reese. With Royal, Ren, and Reese. All of them are doing so good. They are healthy. They're all on breathing tubes right now, but that's, that's typical when they come this early. All are good, and we couldn't be more excited. The doctors did an amazing job. Kara is now asleep. She slept about one hour yesterday. Couldn't sleep. I slept maybe two hours. There have been so many doctors on call helping out and doing such an amazing job. Thank you so much, guys. Good night, Reese. We love you. Welcome to the world. I love that they have this Nikki view, these cameras. You can see our babies all from home. That's really, really cool. And your sister Gemma, I can't wait to meet you. Sweet boy girl, I love you. This is the one that delivered them. And that's our daughter's name. <laughs> Dr. Reese, you're amazing. Right. Appreciate hey, it. Congratulations. Thank you so much. You, Sweet little fee. Baby Ren. You're so good, Royal. You're so strong already. I love you. Sleep well. Look at the size of this diaper. Teeny little diaper. Hi, Ram. Hi, sweet girl. You got your hair all combed and you got a cute bow on your head. And you're just chilling with your leg out. Just relaxing. Love you, Ram. Sleep well. Babies are all doing good. They're all dressed, bathed, bows on, looking cute. Now we're gonna go check on Kara to see how she's doing. She is a champ. I'm actually blown away at how well she did. I'm so tired, I keep falling asleep. Yeah, I don't blame you. And I had to get a little oxygen because my oxygen levels were dropping. Hey, it looks good on you. I had to get a second IV in case I need a blood transfusion because I'm losing a lot of blood. Of course, you're gonna lose a lot of blood, but Kara was losing a little more than normal, so they're monitoring her to see if they need to give her some blood transfusion. How calm Kara was. She hates needles. She was kind of afraid of a spinal block because they numb most of your body. These babies are gonna be amazing because of Kara. Like, this girl right here is a trooper. Like, I owe it all to her. They were cute from what I saw. Look at how many bracelets we got. <laughs> like, just come to the hospital with triplets and you're set and you got enough bracelets for for a while. Baby one, baby two, baby three. And then my bracelet that Kara got me. I'm the sun, she's the moon. First star is Gemma, second star is Royal, third star, Reese, last star is Ren. Got the whole fam right there in my wrist. So Ashley over here is just dosing up Kara, just nice. getting her ready for just a nice slumber. Nice. Kara, you're about to go out in like three, two, one. I can't even keep my eyes open. Go to sleep, you deserved it. You're amazing. Good night. Good night. Love you. Love you. First time that Kara gets to meet. Which one? <laughs> oh, this is Reese. Reese Sienna. Let's do some skin to skin with Reese. Do you love being on your mom? 
My beautiful mother came to visit mm. the triplets and they're doing so good. How do they look, mom? They are so amazing. They're beautiful. They're beautiful and perfect. Love her. Love she him. raised twins and so she has a lot of good advice for triplets. <laughs> True. But we're excited. Yeah, we are. So excited. Love you, Love mom. You. My cute little precious. What do you think of her dad? I think she's gorgeous. I was so lucky to have twins. And now to have triplets 30 years later is amazing. What a little precious. This is my father. Happy grandpa. He just gave me three more grandchildren, so he's pretty happy. I'm gonna say hi to Ren real quick. I love you so much. Love you, Ariel. You need to go play for my triplets. Yeah. There's the triplets. They're over there, but I heard about you're the harp lady. Doesn't she just look so good for having three babies today and having no sleep? We have some teeny tiny little footprints. Baby A, we named her Reese. Our Royals. Little footprints. There's Royal Hunter. Baby Ren. Ren Estelle. So pretty. And we're gonna go be wheeled down so we can do more skin to skin See with babies. the second baby. My skin. baby boy. Skin on skin with Royal. He's a good boy. Sweet mm -hmm. Royal and sweet Kara. She's being a power mom. Seriously, this girl can like have children like it's the Olympics and she's going for the gold medal. We hit gold. And you're sucking on your binky. Good job, Reese. We're proud of you. Hi, Ren. You waved at me. Hi, Ren. You sweet, sweet girl. This is the first time I've seen your eyes. We love you. Go to sleep. He's gonna be such a sweet little boy to his sisters. This is the first time I've held one of my children. Mm -hmm. Boy, oh, you sweet boy. You're so light. I feel like I'm holding nothing. Look. Look at me. Mm -hmm. I just got done doing skin to skin with two of the babies. We still haven't done Ren. She's done Royal and she's done Reese. And after she does them, I can do them. So tomorrow I'm gonna do skin to skin. And now I have to help her back into bed. What do you have? Are you drinking a hospital drink? Can you say hi to Carly and her new baby? <gasps> Carly, who's that? Say baby Rolly. Roland. Roland. Oh, Roland's so cute. So Emma, you have so many new friends. You, can, you have Jade, you have Roland, you have me, you have mom, you have grandma. You have three babies to choose from. So many buddies. Do you know where mama is? I know. Mama. <laughs> Come on, let's go find Mama. Do you know where your brother and sisters are? Do you want to go find them? <laughs> I'll, follow, I'll follow you. Lead the way, girl. You have a pedal. Pedal. Okay, let's go. Are you excited? Yeah, are you excited to see your brother and sisters? Do you know what their names are? Bubble. Do you? Bubble. It's Royal, Bubble. Reese, and Ren. I actually gotta say them in the order they were born. So it's Reese, Royal, and Ren. That's the order. Yeah. Did you know that Mama already had them? You're gonna meet them really soon. But right now they're in a special, special bed called the NICU. Here, show me how you rub, 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 rub. Gotta put your drink down. Here, okay, rub, rub, rub. Now smell it, make sure it smells good. Does it smell good? Okay, it smells good, there you go. You all clean? Good job. Gemma, it's Ashley. Gemma. Go say hi to Ashley. Kara's other bestie, Ashley. Hi, Ash. Hi. Give me a hug. Oh. Nice to see you. Hi, baby. Oh, you have. 
Hey babe, how are you? Kara just woke up from a nap and she put on her beautiful robe from Target that she went and got right before we came here. It's so soft. It's like wearing a blanket. Day two, I'm doing way better than yesterday. Yesterday, I almost had to have a blood transfusion. I lost a lot of blood after the c-section i was falling asleep like all day long while people were trying to talk to me but today i'm doing good babies are good i have everything removed I feel like a new woman so kara has actually done skin to skin already with two of the babies three you done it with all three yeah i didn't know that i did her in this morning while he was sleeping they want to make sure that you do it with the wife first and when you do skin to skin it has to be for an entire hour because if they're gonna get the babies out and mess with them and get them all all their wires free they want them to be able to like settle and calm and have enough time to really soak it all in not just get them up put them back so they want you to be able to hold them and snuggle them for at least one hour and the babies love it right when they get set on your chest they just like curl up to you and go right to sleep and they're so cute they're like little puppies so now that Kara has done skin to skin with all three, I'm super stoked because right now we're going to go over to the NICU and for the first time I get to do skin to skin with one of the babies. I want you guys to try something on the pool. In your house right now, set a timer for five minutes and wash your hands. It's crazy how long it feels like. So we're sitting here next to who? Ren. Ren. Look, that's my baby. She was the last one to come out. Oh, so I did a hold around? Yeah. Is that okay? That's absolutely okay. She was the last one that we named, so Aww. she's kind of special to us. And uh. mm -hmm. sweet boy, you look cozy in there. Reese needs a little more oxygen, so I gave her this tube around her head. Just so she can get a little more oxygen. But I'll be honest, it kind of makes me want to cry. She's so cute. My precious little bird. So it is currently 3.30 a.m. Kara had to do her pump. So this thing's actually pretty cool, but you put pretty much two tubes because you know, yeah. It's starting to come slowly, I think, but there's no milk, it's actually colostrum. It helps build their immune systems. It's just like liquid gold. It's good for them, it fills them up. I've been getting like literally one drop every time one drop and the NICU is like all about it they want that one drop that's like how good it is for the babies so we just pumped and she got two full syringes and then a fourth of another syringe our babies are eating healthy tonight but i'm so excited they have so much good food good healing powerful food that it's 3 30 a.m and i'm gonna run it over there my babies don't wait for good food Look at that, there's food for Ren. She's gonna be so happy. Here you go, Ren, I gave you, I gave you a lot of food. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's how happy you are, huh? Oh, you sweet girl. 
He just wants to get that thing off her face so bad she's just grabbing it. Get this off. I ran. Day three. With the royal. Hi, sweet boy. Love He's drooling on me. Let's go check on Ren or Reese. One of the two. This is my beautiful mom. Where's baby Ren? She has to have this mask over her eyes because of the jaundice lights. Ren's holding grandma's hand. Mm -hmm. Sweet girl. Perfect angel fingers. Sweet Ren Estelle. She won't let go of my finger. She just holds on tight, doesn't let go. Such a sweet girl. She loves her daddy's little finger. Love you, Ren. Sweet girl, Reese. Reese is the only one that has this over her head and it's just so she can breathe a little better. Reese is doing really good. She had a spinal tap last night to make sure that she didn't have any bacteria in her spinal fluid. And so far it came back negative. So we're really, really, really happy. How's it feel okay to get that special treatment again at the hospital? Feels great. Just like at the mall. Here come the bumps. Nice and easy, please. Nice and easy. <laughs> I got you, girl. She's so worried about the bump. She thinks I'm gonna go over He flew over them and it freaking hurts my C-section incision. Look how amazing they are. Chose to get rosemary chicken and rice, sparkling apple juice. Steak and shrimp. <gasps> Steak and, that's my kind of girl. Steak and shrimp. I got chocolate bunk cake. Here, I got some cheesecake. A date night in the hospital. Cheers, babe. Here's to a new beginning. Cheers. A new beginning with a new family. We got to the tops off. Let me get that for you real quick. It is now day four in this beautiful hospital room. Did you guys see Kara? They anticipate that they're gonna be in there for about a month, but we are praying that we can get them home sooner. What about you, babe? Are you ready to get out of here? Are you sick of this hospital room yet? No. <laughs> No. I'm treated like royalty. Fresh ice water. Bring me Lorna Dune cookies. <laughs> My favorite cookies here. The Lorna Dunes are actually really, really good cookies. She has a little call button. They come and tend to her every need. They're super accommodating. I'm afraid to go home because then I'm just stuck with this guy. Okay, I vouch to take care of you. This is our sweet little baby bird, Ren. And she is the youngest of the triplets. But she's also doing the best with her breathing. So when they first brought her into the NICU, she was at a seven on this LP. Is this her oxygen level? A seven. It's already to a 2.5. And at two is when they can maybe start trying to breastfeed, right? Sweet Royal Hunter. Royal, our little Benjamin Button boy. He's really like wrinkly and he's the most bald. So he kind of just looks like a little grandpa baby. He's already down to a 3.5 from 7. Good job, little buddy. You're working your way to catch up to your sister. We're going to have so much fun. We're going to play t-ball. I'm going to be your coach. I'm going to teach you the piano. I'm going to teach you how to respect women and protect your sisters. We're going to work out together. We're going to go to movies together. We're going to go ride bikes and hike together. And most importantly, I'm going to teach you that family is everything. Um, Hi, little Reese. This is little Reese. Reese Sienna. And she was the first born, but she's the smallest. She's our tiny little Thumbelina girl. And she has the most hair. When Gemma was born, she had no hair, like none. She has struggled a little bit more with the breathing and oxygen than the other two have. <laughs> So Ren is just really long. She's kind of like Gemma. Oh, look at how long you are. Your little wrinkly legs. Yes, she and then on her, under her eye. Mama. Like, Sorry, you're not gonna like this. She just wants to hold hands. Her eyes are open. That's our other baby crying over there. Okay, she's like, I want a bath. She's open like, your eyes and see your daddy. Mm -hmm. She was like laughing. Just here. 
There's a little eyebrow. Oh, you laughing? This is so funny. Hi, Ray. Hi, Look at you. Do you want me to turn his head that way? The amazing nurse, Tavany, helped us out by washing all our babies. He watched her wash all of them. Usually they split them up, but Tavany took all three tonight. Tavany, we love you, thank you. You're welcome, it's fun. They're adorable. Appreciate it. Who's your favorite? I'm just kidding. <laughs> you can't tell us that. I can't say that. But Reese has been super sweet today. Yes, she has. So Dr. Reese popped in, it is day five, Sunday. Dr. Reese cleans up quite nicely. Mm -hmm. Shower. You look nice. I need a shower. I need a shower. <laughs> shower so, can Kara go home she, today? She's on her way home. She certainly can go home. Doing fantastic. So, Yay. you go see Gemma. You go see Gemma. You believe it? They're doing been yeah. perfect. She's the perfect patient here. So, yeah. And Dr. smiling Reese. still. Dr. Reese yeah. delivered yeah. Reese first. So, it's yeah. Uh -huh. We named Reese after Dr. Reese. Yeah. <laughs> of course he did. <laughs> More is a good coincidence that Dr. Reese just showed up. <laughs> That's a good awesome. thing. Huh? Thank you, Doctor. Right, appreciate it. Congratulations, Thank you guys. You. Thank you. Yeah. Babe. We are going home. She's Can healthy. See my gemmers. Got my staples out and it actually didn't really feel it. I was so scared. We well, look amazing. Let's go see our baby girl Gemma. Got a car pulled up. Load okay. up. It's been good. I'm gonna go home and see Gemma. Alright, it's day five. Reese. Can we say goodbye before we go home? Your little hands stole my heart. Your little feet. Ran away with it. Luciana, I love you so, so, so much. Learn to breathe on your own, learn to eat on your own. Grow, grow, grow. Sweet boy. My sweet boy. Such long fingers, just like your daddy. Royal Hunter, I love your name. He's a strong man for a strong boy. We'll come visit you every day, also, okay? I promise. We pray for you every single day. I love you so much, bud. We'll see you tomorrow. Cute Ren, that's Ren's first hand, first foot. About the same size. Hi, sweetheart. Hey, come here. Ren, you have such a firm grip. Hey, sweetheart, we'll see you soon, okay? You take care of your brother and sister. Watch over them. They're just, just over there and over there. This is called the Chatwin Corner. Keep on growing. You're doing so good. Your oxygen, 1.5. You're doing so good. I love you. Bye, sweet Ren. So I just pulled up to our house. Kara's mom brought her home, so they're already inside. It's actually funny because when people found out we were having triplets and we told a lot of people, a lot of people said the same thing. They said, I'm sorry, you're having triplets. I'm so sorry. Don't be sorry. Do not be sorry. I am the luckiest guy in the world and I already have one. I get three more of God's little angels. Don't be sorry. So now that we're home, we get to continue on daily life, but we will visit them as much as possible. They're in such good hands over there. All the nurses, all the doctors, so accommodating. Like we couldn't have had a better experience. Thank you so much guys for your love and for loving our triplets and for coming in and waking us up in the middle of the night and giving us updates on how they were doing. We couldn't be more appreciative of that. All the lost sleep, it's worth it. Kara's already seen Gemma. I get to go see Gemma. I missed her so much. Do I see a Gemma? Do I see a Gemma? <gasps> I missed you so much. Come here. Give me a hug. Come here. I want a hug so bad. Come here. Give me a hug. <laughs> I missed you so much. Go say hi to your mama, but be careful. Careful. She's had surgery. You can't jump on mama. Jump next to mama. Oh. That's so nice. Mama. 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 I love you. Kara, how's it feel to be in your bed? Good. Except for I can't get in and out of it. Mama. It's too tall. Wow. Up. 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 You're going to jump? Up. Okay, you have to jump to daddy. That okay, you want to jump to me? Jump to daddy. Uh oh. I'm not going to do this. You better catch her, oh. she's coming. She, oh my god. <laughs> hey Gemma. Oh, it feels so good to be home with my Gemmers in our own bed. <laughs> with Kara, babe. Thank you. Say bye. Can you wave? 
Can you wave? Bye. Bye, guys. They're everything you ever want. They're everything you ever need. And the trips are in front of you. This is where you want to be. Last night was our first night away from the babies. It's so sad, but we're gonna go visit them right now. Hey Pia, you're gonna be a big sister, a big little sister. Right now the babies are about your size, Pia, but they're gonna outgrow you real quick. Then Gemma. Gemma thinks that she's Pia's boss. Uh, right there. Whoa, Kara, that's crazy. Turn side to us. Look, my bump is gone. Yeah. Remember when it was it's out long. to here? Yep, it's flat. Okay, how does that feel? It feels so light. Light as air. Do you want to do some jumping jacks? No, except <laughs> I can't move still. It's kind of like I still have it because I'm still like, I can't bend over, I can't pick things up. Yeah. Okay, it's skin to skin with two babies at once. Oh yeah, last night. Yeah, tell them about that. I got to hold Royal and Ren together on my chest, skin to skin. And they were so cuddly and so cute. The neonatologist called this morning and said, Reese should be off of her oxygen by this afternoon and off of her IV fluid and that they might all be in a bigger crib all together, all three of them for the first time. So we're gonna go and see. It's getting cold in Utah, guys. But pretty soon the snow is gonna be coming. Mm -hmm. And then the triplets are gonna have their first snowy winter wonderland. And Gemma loves. She would go to our back door right here and we'd get our snowsuit on and we'd just crack the door open and she would play out there on our balcony where the snow is forever just by herself. This is also what I'm excited for. But let there be light. And now that Kara is three babies lighter, um, I might actually go sit through a movie. We can go to a movie. And Kara, my mom, has Gemma, Gemma tonight. tonight. Overnight. That's true. That means date night date popcorn. Night. Movie theater popcorn. Movie theater popcorn. Butter. Headed in to visit the babes. They're doing so good. The doctors called us and they said that they have all of them off of oxygen now. They started putting some of them together so they can talk to each other. It's so fun. Can't wait to see them. Kara, what do you got there? Some I come more, bearing gifts. Some more liquid gold. Some milky milk. Kara comes with frankincense, gold and myrrh. Liquid gold for our babes. Time to phone sanitize. Wipe down your phone. Oh, and I got my ring off. How'd you do it? And uh, my knuckles went down, so I'm keeping it off oh, till we're done you just, with you just the NICU. <laughs> Why do we do that to our phones? Because they're filthy. It's literally the dirtiest thing. You need to put it in the bag. But the best part about this bag is that you can still catch. So this happened today. Kara. Oh my gosh. There's three babies. One, two, three. Who's who? Reese. Royal Ren. See, she doesn't need a hat because she's so hairy. <laughs> no, Reese has so much hair, she doesn't need a hat. Royal, hi buddy. Boy, you just smile you just smiled and then you yeah. frowned. Then sad real quick. Ren, hi Ren. Hi girlfriend. My heart is literally melting. <laughs> How cute this is. Royal, you don't need to be sad. Royo, don't be sad. Hey. Royo, you're waking up, Ren. Hi, Ren. Is your brother waking you up? That's going to be a reoccurring thing. Waking each other up. But we can't wait for it. Royo, can you smile for your dad? -da? Royal, come on. Can I see your pearly white? Are you blowing bubbles? Royal, are you blowing bubbles? Your dad does here. I love you, Royal. Royal, you're in it with your sisters. It's a royal sandwich. Reese, you smile too. Reese. I saw that. You snuck one in there. Reese, hi. Hi, sweet girl. Royal, you're smiling too. You guys just all smiling. 
just a happy family. The happy trio. Ren, where's your smile? Ren. Can I see a smile? They're wearing clothes. Nice, you have clothes on. Like a real baby. You're like a real infant. You have a binky in there with you You're too. almost to the newborn stage. <laughs> She's like, hold Not on, really. hold on, hold on, guys. Guys, hold on, hold on. Kara is so good at changing diapers. I am so good at watching. I'm the best watcher. Sweet little Reese baby. is so lucky today. She's the first one to get on mama. <laughs> She's squeaking. Little mouse. Hey, you little squeaky girl. I love her fuzz. I love you, royal. You are so royal. Both have pretty dark hair. Friends, just a little baby bird. Yeah. Date night was a success. Gemma is with grandma. We just left the hospital. We went to dinner and we went to a movie and that's why we're here at our house right now because... Then we went to the gas station. I went to the gas station and got treats. Oh. And then I asked him for like two hours to look up the movie times and to like get <laughs> tickets, whatever. So we went to the movie theater. He still hadn't done any of it and... Well, it's Tuesday night. The seats were It's Tuesday full. night. Who the freak goes to a movie on Tuesday? Tuesday's the cheap night. And then I realized, realized, oh yeah, it's the day that it's discounted. So it was full of people. Date night is going to just resume in our house. We're going to go find a movie. We'll let you know what we We'll what eat we our pick. treats in bed. And catch up on our emails. Since Gemma is gone, I can play the piano for like the first time in forever because she's not here to cry and make me sad because every time I play, she gets emotional. Gemma, Reese, Royal, Ren, Kara, Pia. That was for you. So how was it today in the NICU? Good. Really special today because when we walked in, as you guys saw, all three burritos, <laughs> all three bundles of joy were just facing the same direction and they were just out cold. And I told Kara, that looks like three dolls. They, they were look so cute. Oh. And they were wearing clothes for the first time. They had little onesies on. I'm not gonna show you guys my pillow because I drool a lot and royal jewels after me. People are asking what inspired us to give them those names. Let's get I, up close and personal. I don't know where it came from. You could eat a mic on my face. Oh, too close? So Reese, I don't know where it came from. It doesn't have a special meaning. I just thought it was so cute and I really wanted to use it and Derek didn't really want to use it so we didn't know for a long time if we were going to use it or not, but then at the end I was like, the bottom baby's Reese. I just feel like she's my tiny little baby and i that's what her name is going to be. Royal. My name. Well, I have had i had two names on my boy list that were my favorites and they've always been Asher and Royal. So if we were having two boys, those would have been their names. But since there was one boy, we kind of went back and forth. Like I wanted Asher sometimes, but I still like Royal and he just fell in love with Royal and he just named him that. My thought process behind Royal was, at first we thought, oh, I loved that name, but we thought that's too bold of a name to call him Royal. Like he has a lot to live up to if you're calling him <laughs> Royal. Because we found out last that we were having a boy when we did that gender reveal. It was girl, girl, my heart sank, not because I don't want a fourth girl, but I just wanted one boy. So we got the boy. So now I feel like he's our only boy. 
I feel like he's so special that, yeah, he's royal. That's such a bold name and we wanted to give it to him because it was a bold thing to scare us like that, Royal. And then sweet little Ren. Where did we get Ren? Well, we were scrolling through our YouTube comments and... Thank you, YouTube comments. Derek, I had seen it on there and I liked it. And then Derek saw it and he's like, oh, what about Ren? I actually really like that. And it sounded familiar to me. And I look on my baby list and it was the very last name on my baby list on my phone too. And I don't remember ever putting it on there. I don't know when I saw it or where it came from. I'm like, yeah, I must have liked that too. And I like it now and he likes it. So thank you. This little bird, like this little brown bird. And she's just like this tiny little baby bird. Yeah. It's so fitting. Guys, literally, this is what a wren is. This is a wren. This is a little bird named Ren, like how cute is that? Someone today actually left in the comments like the meaning of each of their names, which is really cute. And Ren, they said, meant ruler, which she is the feistiest one out of all of them. She's the youngest, but she, like all the nurses are like, man, good luck with that one. She's feisty. And when you try to change her diaper or do anything she doesn't like, she is strong. Like. Her legs and arms are the size of my finger and they're like flailing and she'll like grab you and push you away. It's crazy. She's a little ruler. <laughs> the little ruler baby Ren. And another question that I read while I was doing skin to skin and a lot of people have asked this and the reason why we haven't answered it is because it's a legitimate reason and the reason is we do not know. But people ask, are the girls identical? They were in separate sacks, separate placentas, which usually means fraternal, but I guess more recent, what is it, medical discovery? More recent medical discovery shows- You sound super smart. <laughs> shows that they can have separate sacs and separate placentas and still be identical if, they, if the eggs split within like three to four days of conception. I think they're fraternal. They're gonna do a blood test, but not for a little bit. It was so fun visiting our sweet little angels in the NICU today, seeing them all three together. It was like the cutest thing ever. Made it real to see them, like to see three babies in a row. Like we actually have three babies. And then Gemma's kind of a baby still, but she's growing up so fast. Our date night was a success. We're about to hurry and log on and answer some emails and go like some more of your comments. So keep on leaving comments. You guys are all so awesome. Thanks for watching our videos and being part of our family. And we can't wait to show you more. Until next time. Happy, Happy Thanksgiving. From the chat wins <laughs> to you. Pia. Oh, Pia. do you wanna hold oh, Pia? Pia? Can you go get Pia? Okay, hurry, run, run, run. Happy Thanksgiving, guys. We just wanted to share with you what we're grateful for this year. Gemma, I'm super grateful for you. What's up, Bob? <laughs> I am super insanely grateful for my family. I'm super grateful for Kara Marie, who has been just such a good mom. She goes to the NICU probably like six hours a day and just spends time with her babies. Feeds all three, holds them, loves them. Just unconditional love. I'm so grateful for that. I am grateful for God's trust in me to give me all these kids and trust that I can take care of them well and I'm not gonna let you down. I'm grateful for our internet family, our YouTube family, the chat fam. You guys have been so supportive of us and it's been nothing like less of amazing and inspiring. And I'm grateful for good food that we're about to go stuff our faces with. I am grateful. <laughs> For Gemma's musical talent. So musical. <laughs> I'm grateful for my husband and all of his hard work. For his family, he always puts family first. He's so supportive of everything I want to do. He watches Gemma while I go to the NICU for six hours a day. It's so fun. I am so extremely grateful for a healthy pregnancy and healthy babies that might be coming home soon. Wait, Gemma, soon. who made us parents. That was the best gift of all. Ooh, those look really good on you, bud. <laughs> oh. Ooh, Gemma jewelry. Can I put your purse on? Whoa, you actually look really good. She loves broccoli. You love broccoli, huh? Is that broccoli? Oh, 
Did you just eat it? She just took a bite of it. Broccoli it is. Oh, apple. Oh. Can you say apple, apple, ah, ah, ah? Apple, ah, 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 ah. Good job. <laughs> your cart. Go get your cart. Go get your cart. Hey, tell me your cart. All right, we gotta buy. <laughs> we gotta buy these grapes and the uh, apple. Broccoli. This is a full turn out nice. Yeah. Is that yummy? Yeah, just on that wall. Hey, can I buy it? No, thank you. Oh, you don't want to buy it? No, thank you. I'm mama. Okay, she insists. Just fake it. Oh, good job. Mmm, mm, yummy. She's got broccoli, grapes, apples. Oh my god. You are a brachiosaurus. Is that yummy? Just an I'm herbivore. Yummy. Mmm. No, 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 no. Little bites. Little bites. Wow. You're gonna eat all of them before we leave. We should get one of these to do as an activity with her. That'll be a sweet little family <laughs> night. Gemma, can you stop doing that until we buy it? <laughs> Good grief. Gemma, you are probably the only two year old that does that. Oh, she just added a bottle pop. Gemma's really yeah, random stuff. stuff. Now we have some really exciting news coming soon. But first, we really need to clean this house. All I see is boxes and boxes. And, and then, surprise! You're so full of surprises. Yes. Show me your cute face. <laughs> oh, you're gonna be nice to Pia. Can you say sorry? Just say sorry. Just Show everyone. Good job. Push. Yeah! <laughs> clap, clap, clap. Close your eyes. Fold your arms. Sit down on the ground. Do a sit up. <laughs> good, that's good sit up. Do a squat. That's a good squat, Gemma. Wow. Okay, now just run that way. Just run. Welcome back guys, the house is clean. We have some really exciting things happening tonight. 
This day has come a lot faster than we were expecting. It's only been three weeks since the babies were born and we were expecting about three more weeks. Gemma, are you getting pretty? She's always pretty. You are always pretty. Gemma, why are you so pretty? Hey, you look like Tinkerbell. Don't run away from your dad, Dad. Hey. Emma, you look like Tinkerbell. Can you snuggle me? This looks like you just want a poker bat. Mine. Why do you have so many binkies? Bibs sent them to us. They're called Bibs USA. It's almost as if we're having a lot of babies. <laughs> Those with kids will agree with me that you can never have too many binkies. They just somehow get misplaced everywhere. Binkies just go places. These are cool colors too. Yeah, they have the best colors. You can have one. What Gemma, color do you want? One. Choose uh, one. Um, go, go. Um, black? Okay. Ooh, black. You definitely are Kara's daughter. <laughs> I like black. Uh, Can you say thank you, Mama? Uh, Mom. Can you say thank you, Bibs? Uh, mm, okay. <laughs> go. Uh, hold on, Gemma. Oh, Gemma, you didn't hold on. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Gemma. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. This is where I went and put all those binkies in that cereal bowl. Remember? And then I brought it over to you. You are so weird. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> So at this point, we pretty much have gotten the triplets everything. Their clothes, the docket tots, binkies on binkies on binkies. Car seats, bassinets, cribs. But the one thing that we didn't have was the car. I told Derek that we need a minivan. <laughs> the minivan, yeah. I'm telling you, that is the last thing on earth I would ever get. I will never, ever, ever in a million years own a minivan. We made it. We made it, babe. We made it. Never in a million years did I think that we would be looking at minivans. Okay. Looks like the Nene Cool Dad got a whole lot cooler. Dad life, baby life, four kids life, triplet life. Gemma life. Okay. Let's get your You're so pretty. Oh, her <laughs> hair. No, it's all know. staticky. I don't know what happened. Okay. 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 So we can be nice and warm. Okay. Um, nice, nice warm. warm. Oh, there you go. All right, Gemma. Gemma, we're going to go in there and you're going to demand a good price, okay? Hey, I nannied in New York and I drove a van. And that's really the only reason that I want one. Is Why? Was it good? It was so convenient. Like, I would take the twins to preschool, push a button. They could unbuckle. Oh, oh. They were four. They could unbuckle run inside by themselves the teachers were waiting outside push the button closed drive off with the toddler easy geez okay stop selling me on it <laughs> it was the best maybe i'll get one whoa so look at this cool little contraption okay you can't pick Gemma, are we in a car dealership? Wow, that's actually really cool this is the most detailed little house thing i've ever seen inside of a car dealership kara do you like that thing the Highlander. Pass. I love the practice though with the nurse there. I asked you like all the time. But there's popcorn, your favorite mm. thing in the world. Mmm. Mm. Can you say thank you, Mama? You're welcome. Thank you. Two. Oh, Whoa. Whoa. This is a cool truck, huh? Jump, jump. Gemma, your ride's here. Here you are, Gemma. Let's go, you princess. Go for a ride? Give me your hand. Let's go. Let's go, princess. We're gonna go in the golf cart and we're gonna ride over to see all the minivans. Uh, I, the house Devin bought no. a few years ago in the same no. area. Yeah. Here we go, bud. Just getting the royal treatment. Royal. <laughs> hey, royal. You are a royal sweetheart. Mwah. Is this fun? Uh, oh my goodness. Look at these vans. Yeah, you ready to go? Okay, let's go look at the minivans. 
your price difference monthly would be. Jim, look at this. This is a black Dow. Not too bad, actually. Just need some tint. What do you think, Kara? Did you think this would be your life? Because I <laughs> no. sure didn't. I never thought we would have four in car seats at one time. I never thought I'd be shopping for a minivan. But that's why we're shopping for a minivan. Oh. She's just here for the popcorn. <laughs> She's here for the popcorn and her hair is just all sorts of static. <laughs> you want to go for a ride? Um, uh, Do you want to be in our vlog? No? Okay. Okay. Just send me hey guys, we did it. We pulled the trigger. <laughs> Got the dream car. It's done. The triplet wagon. The triplet mobile. The triplet mobile has been purchased. Signed some papers, waiting for him to go get the key. And it's seat seven, so we have room for one more still. We'll show you guys soon. <laughs> There's a lot of room in there though. It's actually really nice. Leather seats, heated, sunroof. I just became a super dad. I'll show you guys soon. Instead of champagne around here, pop some bags. The house is spotless. Every surface is squeaky clean. Kara babe, why art thou holdest a bag? So what's going on? You have a bag? It's 11 p.m. Where are you going? You going on a weekend getaway? We are going to have a sleepover with the triplets. A sleepover. And if all goes well, they will be home in the morning. So if all goes well. We have to pass the test first. <laughs> pass the parenthood <laughs> test. Can you survive a three? I don't know. Well, can I come? You have to come. It's your bag. This is it. Final showdown. The moment we've all been waiting for. We're gonna see if we can pass the father and motherhood test. If they trust us to take our babies home. Pretty sure we're gonna pass, what do you think? Yeah. Kara, if we fail the test, just know that it's not your fault. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> it's probably my fault. <laughs> oh yeah, that was a special night. Look at how clean our house is. We scrubbed that baby from top to bottom. We got it clean. That was the last night that we ever saw our house without these triplets. Those are kind of like the easy days. <laughs> Let the adventure begin. Whoa. What's this room, Kara? This is our <laughs> sleepover room. The sleepover room. Please. We got like a queen bed. Is this a queen? I think I, this Or it's like a, like full. a full. Either way, it's dope. Where was that thing when Kara was here? Yeah. I was sleeping on a little mini couch. They were going to bring the triplets right there. And we we're going to sleep with them. <laughs> With nurses close, but they're not gonna come in, so we gotta be parents. And it's almost 3 a.m. I did not realize like what we have in store. We just sat over there with the triplets and every three hours they need to be fed and then have their diapers changed. It's like 30 to 40 minutes to do each one. So by the time we finish the third baby, we have like an hour to sleep hour before we have to wake up again and start again. again. Guys, I don't know what I signed up for. <laughs> this thing, I didn't even know this is on my face. That's how tired I am. Oh, gosh, Going Kara. longer between feedings, right? Authentic. The authentic life of having triplets. You care, wake me up in an hour. Oh, has it been an hour? <laughs> oh, it's been one minute. <laughs> oh. And now that we're back in the NICU, we are back to the plastic case. Good night, chat fam. We'll see you in an hour. <laughs> oh, look. They're so nice. They put a picture of Gemma in here. Gemma? <laughs> Oh my gosh, they just brought him in. We are officially alone with the triplets for the first night. So it begins. Day one of a million. Help. Help. Help us. So we can get 45 minutes of rest. 45 minutes starts now. It is now 7 a.m. Kara. 8 a.m. Oh, it's 8 a.m.? Who the freak knows anymore? Not me. So Kara and I are running off of Probably 45 minutes total. Me, I feel like I haven't slept at all. Everything is true, what people have said. Good luck getting sleep. I'm like, yeah, we'll sleep fine. No, this is the reason why. Literally the cutest things on earth. Rand, little sweet Royal. Don't wake them up though. And sweet little Reese. You guys are all so cute. So every three hours, you start with Reese, change her diaper. Changing an infant's diaper is a whole new ball game. You feel like they're so delicate that you just like don't want to hurt them and they're kind of kicking and ah, oh, I can't even, it's just so much harder. They're so precious. 
these machines do not stop beeping and making noises and just waking us up and waking the babies up. This is the first night with them and I'll be honest, it is an absolute trip. It wasn't easy, but we're gonna do it. We all are supposed to be asleep. Okay, sweet peas. The only thing that we ask is that you just go to sleep, please. I love you, I love you, Ren. I love you, sweet royal. Reesey Pooh, I love you. Please, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Right. Hi, Ren. Any other concerns or questions for me that I can help you with? Cute. 1 p.m. Okay, it's 1 p.m. Now, how much Still did you sleep? <laughs> you haven't moved. <laughs> how much have you slept now? Like an hour and a half. Okay, Red, can you keep it in? Red. So during the night, guess how many times I changed our diapers? Let's see if you guys can guess. 18 diapers in one night. In one year, that's 6,570. I did the math in my head with the help of Kara's calculator. That is a lot of diapers. I'm the diaper king. Special delivery. Oh, thank you. Is my little Reese? Little Reese, he's hungry. Are you hungry, girls? <laughs> oh. Reese, you sweetheart. In about maybe an hour, these are going to be filled with little munchkins. Okay, I know you're attached, but give me the baby. I have a new one coming your way. She's so snappy. Royal now needs food. She's just a little cuddle bug. Here. You just want to run your fingers to it. Royal, what is that face you're making? Special delivery. Royal incoming. Thank you. All right, Royal. Hope you're hungry. Mom's prepared okay, a really okay. nice meal for you. Some pumped milk. Go <laughs> <laughs> get the pumped milk. All right. <laughs> bon appetit, Royal. Feed your triplets and film at the same time. <laughs> He's the loudest eater. <laughs> yeah, he takes that bottle quick. He's the best nurser too. I love his little wrinkles. <laughs> He's so grandpa. Incoming Ren. And she gets more pumped milk. Yay! <laughs> pumped milk. Bon appetit, Ren. Love you. Ren. Is that yummy? Mama's so, milk. So Ren's the best eater, right? Yeah. She's the best eater, but. Just well, if it comes to nursing, Royal's the best. Just bottle feeding, Ren is the champion. She's a bottle bird feeder. Yep. Bottle bird feeder, Ren. She just likes the bottle. It's easier. Oh, this is happening. They are officially getting in their first outfits. They all have matching love baby onesies. Dressing them like a trooper. <laughs> There's little Reese all ready to go home. Royal. Royal Hunter is making his debut. He is leaving. Let's get out of here, bud. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So small. Ben doesn't want to be left behind. Not Don't yet. worry. Just okay. everything in. We're not going to leave you. Yeah. Let's see. It's happening. Ready to go? Here they are. Da -da. Ready to go home. Hi, Reese. You look so cute. <laughs> Hi, Royal. You look so cute. Hi, Ren. You look so wow. You look so awake. Ren, ready to go? Wow. This is a weird sight. Beautiful, though. Okay, Kara, can you carry all three? Yeah, got okay. it. Okay, <laughs> let's see you do it. Ren, Estelle, I love you so much. We're leaving the hospital finally. We're going home. We're going to be able to meet Gemma, your uh. big sister, Royal Hunter. I love you so much. Going home, you're going to be a big protector to your little buddies. And you're going to meet your big sister, Gemma, and Pia, Reese, Sienna. Your name is really significant. It has a lot to do with our car. <laughs> your, your brother and sister, they might be jealous. But we love you, Reese. And I also can't wait until Gemma Marie meets you. It's going to be soon. Can't wait to see her reaction. What do you think Gemma's going to do? What do you think is going to be her reaction? I think she's going to say, babies! 
and then she'll look at them, and then she'll go play with her toys. Baby, baby, oh. baby, oh, run. I think she might try to help with like diapers and blankets. So Gemma's at her house being babysat. As soon as we walk through the doors, we're gonna have three little special cargos, and she always runs to us, Mama, Dada. <laughs> and she's gonna be really surprised. I'm actually really excited to see her action. Yeah, me too. And we got a new car. <laughs> It's done. It rhymes with skinny man. <laughs> in the it's new time car. Time to go. Let's load him up in the new car. Okay, guys, we're really gonna have to take a few trips, but let's go. Hi, Dad. <laughs> let's go, let's load him up. Good job. Um, just wish me luck. Family, this is for all my prodigy. I don't know how this happened. I don't know how I got a minivan. But I love it already, it has so many features. All right, ready? If we didn't have Gemma have to be in this seat, this would be the easy go, way. Let's see you do it. I don't think she'll, it'll fit with this seat. There. Wait, Let this one's Born first. Goes in the car last. All right, Reese, ready? Done. Easy doors. That is why I love my minivan. Let's go home. Our new blacked out minivan. Let's go. Don't open your door. Let's I got go you. Home to our new reality. There you go, princess. Thank you. Ooh, how's that new car smell? Has that new baby crying sound. This is crazy. All the staff at the NICU, you guys, literally angels. You kept our babies alive and healthy. We literally love you. Thank you. Right there, that's why our kids might be jealous. Sienna, Reese Sienna. Can't favor one or the other. So this is now the Sienna Estelle Hunter van. <laughs> you guys wanna watch some movies? Derek cannot film and drive because we have precious cargo. Derek Hunter Chatwin is driving a minivan. And At least it has my daughter's middle name on it though. And? And I love it. <laughs> like it's so smooth. Like this ride, it's so smooth. There's no short term movies going on. Yeah, no watching movies while we go to Target, Gemma. You heard it here first, folks. <laughs> okay, gotta go. All right, let's get her out. Hey bud, we're home, let's go. Gemma. Gemmers. So we put Gemma in the other room real quick while we situated the babies right here. <laughs> and for the first time, we're gonna bring her in and we're gonna see her initial reaction. She has never seen them before, ever. All right, Reese, Reese, Royal, Ren, welcome home. They're all asleep. And it's time to see what Gemma thinks. Gemma, come here. Gotta show you something. Look. 
Look at the babies. Oh, is it great? They're little babies. Gemma. Oh, and I met you. And Those, I that's your brother and sisters. Oh, that's a me. Gemma, that's not yours though, because you already have one. That one. <laughs> and guess what? We have a big dog atop for you, and you have big blankets. Just like Mom, that. Gemma, say hi. hi. Go say hi to. You can go look at them. <laughs> oh, baby. Can you say hi? Touch them really hi, soft. Baby. Hi, baby. Oh, I can't see. Yeah, come here. Do you want me to tell you their name? Okay. Baby Wren. And this is Baby Royal. And baby Ro Ro. Baby Ro Ro. Baby Reese. Oh, soft. She has little hair. You can touch Royal. Royal. Soft. Oh. Oh. Say hi to Ren. Hi, Ren. Say hi, Renny Ren. Touch softly. Don't put that in your mouth. That's not yours. Good. Be soft. Be soft. Softly. Be soft. Look. Good job, though. That's, yeah. Job. That's exactly where it goes, Gemma. She sleep. That's so nice. <laughs> Look at her. 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 Look Look at her. 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 She's like, okay, I want to play with Pia now. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Babies are home. Oh, Gemma, can you give her a hug? Give her a hug. Can you give him a hug? Give Roy a hug. Oh, that's so nice. Can you give Roy a hug in the middle? Oh, she's like, I'll hug my sister. <laughs> Only the girls. <laughs> Wait, Gemma. Gemma, you didn't hug the boy. No, oh, you're gonna do some makeup? Gemma has her makeup bag. Okay. Oh. Oh my gosh. So, you don't have any germs are in there? Careful, Gemma. Yeah. Alright, be, be careful, Gemma. <laughs> Yay! Good job. Good job. Go like this. Go like this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna pick her up. Oh, that's so good. Oh, she's got her Oh, that's so good. Can you say babies? I love babies. Babies. Love it. Look, look, I love look. you. Oh. Like oh, Gemma. Yay. Gemma had to go get hers. Okay, Gemma, you have yours. Of course. You have yours, Aranoni. And the babies have their of little course. baby Aranonis. Um, that one's for Royal. I, um, uh, baby, I, me. Baby, me. Royal. Oh, Ren's just covered under here. Hi. She's wide awake. Ren. You're so pretty. Ren is gorgeous. They all are. But Ren is the only one that doesn't have tubes right now. And her face just looks so good. You have a baby on me. You have a baby on me. Lay on you. Okay. Wanna hold a baby? Wanna hold a baby? Wanna hold a baby like this? Yeah. Slowly. You can't, you can't do that though, Gemma. Look at Grandma. You gotta be really Slow. soft. Okay. Yeah. Yes, Ooh, nice. yeah. Put your arms out. Put your arm out. Like this. Oh, no. Put your arms out. Like grandma. Like grandma. Like this. Okay. It's okay, Ren. Ren's like, I'm hungry. Gemma, look at you. Look. <gasps> Gemma, that's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Your baby sister. Your sister. Sisters too. Baby. Um, I, I knew what I was gonna do. Do you like her? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, wasn't that fun? Hey, guys. You held the baby. Yay! Yay! Okay. Oh. Jammers. 
The triplets are home. Oh, you want music? Okay. Okay, say please. Say please. Okay. Okay. Ready? Be careful, be careful. Can you hold the bottle for the baby? Mm. Okay. That one's for Royal. Gemma, okay. thanks for helping out with the babies. Yeah. Good job. Thank you. This is Kara's sweet mother, Bonnie. Hello. Who is staying with us for three months and has been so, so extremely helpful. Since there's three babies, it kind of works out. Good night, Reese. Is that yummy? What did you find? A Mimi. A Mimi? <gasps> so this room, that's Gemma's big bunny. Of course, wherever there's balloons, you're gonna find Pia, just go in ham sandwich. Get it, Pia. Get it, get it, Pia, get it. <laughs> Has a little sunroof. So this will be the big playroom for all the kids. <laughs> Gemma. Say something, please. Save it for the house tour, but gas bedroom, a bathroom in there. Ooh, cool rock. This is a room with a treadmill. Doesn't get used often, but this is the coolest thing ever. Our neighbors have a tree out there that is so lit up. It's like the only thing they put lights on, and there are so many lights. It's the tree of life. This will be Gemma's new room, but we can't show you right now. It's a work in progress. And Gemma loves stars, therefore, stars on the wall. All right, stay tuned for the house tour. We'll show you all of it. Hey, when's the house tour gonna be? Good question. I don't know, soon. Do you give your meat a royal? Be real gentle, whisper here. Gemma, be soft with the babies. Gemma, it's a baby. Gemma, you gotta be quiet and soft. What's, what's going on with your hair? Good job. Well, that's good, it's not covered. Look at how cute. We got three mamaroos just going along like a little circus over here. Of course, each baby has their Serenoni blanket and Reese. Royal has the black mamaroo. Okay. <laughs> Ren. Ren, you're so cute. Your arm got out. Are you in the baby car seat? Baby egg. You pulled out your hair ties. Where'd you put them? Oh, yes. <laughs> really? I love our babies. Oh, Derek. Gemma, really, really soft, okay? It looks like a big bug with antennas. I'm just gonna keep the camera right here at this level. If you're wondering what's going on, the mother is creating food. She's using her beautiful body to create food. And this is what Kara does 24 seven. Pump, pump, pump. Mostly, sometimes we supplement with formula. Most of the time I pump for all of them mm. or try to nurse one. <gasps> Did, can you open the window? Good job, Gemma, so smart. Gemma, who's that? Hello. <laughs> Give him a hug, Gemma. Freaking hugs. It's Kyle Fisher. Look at his clothes. He's popping in. Dude, this is pretty cool, man. You are a blessed man, I'm telling mm. you. God only gives multiples to very special people. So you're, you're acting like you have multiples. I do. Kyler also has twins, Tatum and Oakley. What is? We're just looking at your camera, Kyler. Oh, good. It's uh really nice. So, Kyler, where's your other half? She's in California. I'm in Utah, and it's freezing here. That was really sad, but I'm filming a movie right now. Tell us about it. It is. Uh, it's about. Well, I can't tell you. I can't tell mm. you yet. I'm excited to watch it. Okay. Dude, I love movies. Why don't you come be in the next one? All right. Gemma, how come you keep on pulling your thing out? Daddy, it's not time to have pigtails. I'm tired. Try to go to sleep now. Gemma, are you tired? Wanna go night-night? Night-night. Go night-night. Go night-night. Come go night-night. Come here. You miss my baby. Gemma, you can go night-night? miss my baby. It looks like Tamer Oakley right here. Yeah, for real. Okay, go night-night. Go night-night. Go sleep. 
She's like, what are you doing to me? He's a nice Here dog. you go, Gemma. Night-night. Here's, here's your turtle, okay. And here's, here's your bow. And here's your other one. And here's this one. Oh, Gemma, where are you? <laughs> you sweetheart. Is Kaiser funny? Is it a he or a she? She. Little girl. Oh! Are you ready to eat? So... I know, yes, you're hungry. You Look at your daddy. You could pass over my brothers, dark hair. Yeah, I think so. That makes a good Glenn Ryder. Madison used to be a Rapunzel yeah, at know. one point for a magical place. And uh, I used to be really jealous of the Flynn Rider. Smolder. Yeah, let's see it. Dude, yeah, know if that's hold it off. Baby, dude, you wanna know how you carry him? Hold yeah, yeah, yeah. When yeah. you're walking. You know? And you got two of them. But since you have three, it's kind of difficult, you know? I've always carried him like this. Yeah. Dude, I need all the tips. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Look at those Ooh. dark eyes that don't change for how long? Are you putting hand sanitizer on? Good girl. Rub, rub. Ooh, good girl. Oh my gosh. Ren, what color eyes are you gonna have? Dad, Dad's eyes are really dark brown. What's up, guys? Hey. I better leave you guys back to your duties. You don't want to stay the night? No. <laughs> please, please. Blessed family. Very blessed. Bro, thank you for popping in. We'll come to LA soon. Please Bye. do. Please come hang with us. Gemma, do you want to go to California? <laughs> oh, you smile, Gemma. You sweetheart. Hi, Tyler. Okay, I want some. Imagine how easy it would be having one baby. I can't. It would be nice, huh? We have to have another one just so that we can see how easy it is. I know, our van has a seventh seat. You already said it. <laughs> it does. Can you blow? Here, I'll show you how you do it. Ready? Fly safe. Peace, love, and harmony. All right, bro. See you, we'll see you soon. Okay, see you. See you real soon. Yep. Did Kyler leave? Oh, buddy. Did Kyler leave? Who's your friend, huh? These aren't for balloons. These are the oxygen tanks. Hi, Reese, sweet girl. Wow, Ren. You are looking adorable right now. You look so cute, girl. Remember when you were in the NICU and I held your hand like this? Our boy ran away. Have you guys seen Royal? Ren, have you seen Royal? Reese? Oh, I found Royal. <laughs> Ren is off of oxygen. What one are you? Oh, Reese, okay. These things are amazing. Oh, Reese, you are so cute. That bow is twice the size of your head. There's the computer we ordered. Well, now my exporting won't take eight hours. Hopefully. It's the girls hanging out with each other. Oh, you sweet girls. Are you guys just hanging out? Reese and Ren? Oh, hi, Royal. Oh, Gemma, you're a candy cane. Oh, what a sight. Reese and Royal still have oxygen. We just have them hooked up to a little at-home oxygen tank. So the oxygen that they have is just mainly for feeding. It gives them more endurance while they're focusing on eating. Next Thursday, we're gonna do an at-home trial to see if they can get off of the oxygen. And I can't wait, because they want to see their cute little faces all the time. By the way, Gemma's filming. She's a good filmer, huh? <laughs> good job, Gemma. That right there, that's my whole world. Don't judge me. Your mom just held all three babies for the first time. It's a lot harder than when they were in my belly. <laughs> Seriously, they're so big. It's crazy because Kara's not even due for what? Two more weeks. Two more weeks. And to think that like all three of those are supposed to still be in her belly, that doesn't even make sense. So Ren was right there, but we, we were taking pictures <laughs> instead of a video. I need you to help me. Dada? You like your dada? Oh. Do you love your daddy? Hey, Kara, have you seen Red?
Who are you? Who are you? I'm Derek Chapman. No, I'm Derek Chapman. <laughs> I'm Derek Chapman. I'm Derek Chapman. Give me my baby. Kara! Put the camera down right now. Put it again. Okay, this is tripping me out. So who's that? Are they both Reese? Are they both Rens? I need to sit down. Let's talk. <laughs> I'm Tom Lincoln. No, I'm Tom Lincoln. I'm Tom Lincoln. Name that movie. <laughs> who's your real dada? Gemma, where's your dada? Gemma, who's daddy? Go touch daddy's knee. Which one is dada? Come on. Can you go touch daddy's knee? <laughs> oh, oh, she, she didn't touch. touch. She didn't touch. She's she second touch. guessing. Can you touch dada's knee? Where's dada? Can you touch dada's knee? Which is the dada knee? Hey. Gemmers. Go. Which one's your dada? Hey. Oh, yeah. Dada's hand. Can dada have a kiss? Where? Where's Uncle Dylan? Who's Uncle D? Where is he? <laughs> Which one's Uncle D? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Go touch. touch. Are you done with your gum? Thank you. Um. Will the real Derek Chatwin please stand up? You guys guessed it right, probably. Actually, who knows? This is Dylan. This is my best friend. This Hi. is my womb partner. Your roommate. Roommate. <laughs> I am the chat twin. So we are the chat twins. Twin is in our last name. No, that wasn't planned, obviously. This is Hi us. guys, I'm Dylan Chatwin. Uh, I'm holding these little angels for the first time. And it's amazing. I think I want one. I'll start with one. Can I just have one of yours? The reason why I had four is if he like wants to take two of them, he can. Can you get a buy one get one free? Yeah, you get a bogo. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually pretty funny. We we were told that we were fraternal, like our whole lives. Mom told us you guys are fraternal, but we looked like pretty similar for being because fraternal. Because we were in separate sacks. So we were fraternal because we were in separate sacks. And everyone, our whole entire lives, we would tell them, "Hey, we're fraternal," and they'd say, "BS, you guys are identical." A lot of people couldn't tell us apart. So, due to recent scientific discovery, I remember when you said that? Yeah. <laughs> possible that, that the sacs or the embryos could have split early. So we might even be identical. So not only are we kind of, these ones are also different sacs. We're going to go do a blood test with Reese and Ren. Me and I go do a blood test too. And we'll show you guys. At the same time. At the same time. And if they're identical and we're identical, that would be crazy. We still don't know. What do you guys think? Are we identical or are we fraternal? There. Now we look identical. There. There we go. So, <laughs> so the question is, are we identical or are we fraternal? Because we're going to find out. It's been 29 years. We are 30 this Wait, month. You're 29? <laughs> no, I'm 20. Yeah, I'm 29. Aren't you 30? When's your birthday? December 20th. My, mine's December 20th too. No! Kara! <laughs> Pewdie Pie! Pewdie, Pewdie Pie! I love saying that. I don't even watch that guy, but I love saying Pewdie Pie. Anyways, it's been 29 years and we still don't know if we are identical twins. People ask us all the time and we say we are just to avoid telling them that the doctor said that we are fraternal, which I don't know. I mean, it's, it's kind of crazy. Like I they're think Brothers fraternal. do not look this much alike. Exactly. Not just, not, not fraternal just brothers literally are just, they're just brothers. So think, like, of, think of like two people that you know that are two brothers and they look so different. That's, that's what a fraternal twin is. That would be us. We would be just brothers and we shouldn't look alike. But we look, I think, so similar and we think exactly the same. I can watch any movie, listen to any song, look at anything and know exactly how he would feel about it. So, exactly. if I do it, Dylan does it. Hi, Gemma. So, I play the piano, Dylan plays the piano. I have to, I have, I have choices. I have triplets, Dylan's most likely gonna pop out triplets. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a nay nay cool dad, dad, dab, dab, cool dad, nay nay. Dylan, do you know what that is? You know what nay nay cool dad, dab, dab is? Yeah. Go watch my vlogs. <laughs> you know what it is. <laughs> you become a cool dad. I'll show you. Uh, I'll show I'm you. Cool. Ready? I'm cool. <laughs> dab! <laughs> All right, Reese. Ready for this, Derek? Okay. I said, Peter, Papa, pick a pen. That's my boy D. D is the man with the gitchy, 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 and the gotcha, 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 and the, yeah, that's the one, man. I love it when you do that dance, baby. I said, yeah. Papa, pick a pen. That's my boy D. D is the man. Man, is it the shoes? Man, you love it when you do your thing, baby. Yeah, yeah. There's definitely some, like, 
twin telepathy. For example, this happens all the time. We'll be sitting there, it'll be, a, we'll talk, have a, have a conversation, it'll be a silent moment where, to kind of break the silence, you know how like you just kind of break out in song? We'll break out in the same exact song at the same exact time, look at each other and be like, you're kidding me. So, I mean, same, it happens all the time. So, like, same even, bravely. The same way, even same like right wavelength. now. On three, break out and just whatever comes to your head. One, two, three. Carry on my way, what's up? No way! Pinky Pie! We're so good. So, Jenny will play the piano, but she plays the. She yeah. plays the cup. <laughs> Gemma, that's so pretty. Gemma, show me how you do that. Can you play your instrument? Play your music and dance. Hey, show me how you this is why I love having a twin though. When things get rough, I just pass it on to my brother. Hey, Dale. Hands are full. Just can't good. move. No, oh. can't move. I feel like you right now. <laughs> I, I feel like zero to a hundred. <laughs> Real quick. Real quick. Yep. <laughs> well, look at That's your Uncle D. <laughs> Ren smiling. Ren's been, Ren has a crush on me. Gemma, I need a, I need a kiss. Come here. I need a kiss right now. <laughs> Look at this, Gemma. <gasps> Boom. Oh, whoa. All right, so the bro is officially leaving. I'm leaving. I'm, I'm leaving. not. I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving. In that movie, chat fam. Nice uh, to meet y'all. I guess you're part of it. I am. I'm officially <laughs> a chat one. Uh, nice meeting you guys. This family is beautiful. Aren't they just great? They're just the cute little. Oh. Ow. <laughs> but here, give me a hug. Love you, bro. Love you. You're my best friend. He's going to Georgia, Atlanta for work, and I actually will be out there shortly for a work trip. So I'll see you in Atlanta. See you in the ATL. Later, baby. Bye. Oh. Oh, put on your heart. Put him on. <laughs> uh, like this. Oh, you put him on your legs. <laughs> Just had to change real quick. Fragile, fragile. Name that movie. I had to get festive because now that there is snow, I have been ordered by the queen to bring out the Christmas tree. Here I am in the wild, in the mountains of Utah. Oh no, just kidding. I'm just about to put up a 12 foot tree by myself. That's how you do it. Oh, the tree's looking just fantastic. Just 12 feet of glory. But you guys, there's one problem we're having. There's one problem here, I'll, I'll let you spot it, ready? Alexa, turn off house. Oh, you found it, there's two problems with this tree. Yep, there's one and there's two. Cannot get that to come on and we cannot get that to come on no matter how hard we try. Karen, where are you? Karen, where are you at? Just move your hand or something so I know you're there. Oh, hey. <laughs> I totally lost you, girl. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. All right, we got one, two, three, four. <laughs> one for every child. Me and Kara just got knocked out. <laughs> we got knocked out this year, guys. Are these two coconuts or two kiwis? Or are they two heads of two precious girls? For those that guess, Ren and Reese, you all right? Hi, sisters. Oh no. Are you guys just looking at each other? Reese and Ren are just hanging out on the same pillow. Roy, are you just over there watching us? Ren, that's your sister. Reese, that's your, that's your sister. <laughs> <laughs> that's your sister. <laughs> oh my gosh. Sweet girls, my sweethearts. Good night. 
All right, girls, this is an overload of cuteness. And I think people on YouTube cannot watch too much cuteness for one day or else their computers are going to explode. So we have to cut this off right now. What's up guys, Dylan here, just taking over a little bit for the chat fam for Derek. Am I Derek or am I Dylan? Hey guys, it's Derek. I actually just got a haircut. Short sides, just like Dylan has. Trimmed the beard, just like Dylan has. Nay, nay, dab, dab, I am a cool dad. My trademark, that's how you know you're talking to the real Derek. Oh, the cutest little daca totters. Nay, nay, and my big baby. And a big daca totter. <laughs> so when you're a big girl on a daca totter, huh? Stop. Watch your oh. feet, you're gonna get the baby. Gemma, are you a big girl sister? Moana, make way, make way. Do your Moana dance. Ariel, which one do you got? I have Reese. Are you sure? How do you know? Um, because I know that runs the other girl and she's not on oxygen. That is true. Yep. Reese, Reese. So cute. Reese, Reese. Okay, who do you have? The good boy. Pia? The Royal good boy, Hunter. Royal. Bonnie, who do you got? This is Ren. Renski. <laughs> it's like, look at me. Look at me. There's Ren. Pia, what do you got? Who do you got? Oh, she's got a gator. From Alabama. She's got a gator that we bought in Alabama. Baby. <laughs> That is so He's funny. like such an Hannah. Like so this is our very first Chatwin review, our product review. And we decided that the product we're gonna review is the Rad 8. The Rad 8. This is the Rad 8. It's just the monitor that all our babies are hooked up on. Royal and Reese. And it tells them if their oxygen is low and if their heart rate is high. Kara, what are your thoughts on, on this? This monitor has the most oh. ear splitting. <laughs> Alarm I've ever heard. Yeah, so there's one volume and it's bleeding ears. I'm so immune to that sound now. We don't even check it anymore. Any of you moms out there took NICU babies home and they have tubes and oxygen and you were given one of these. These amazing things. You know our pain. Because it doesn't go off because of oxygen or heart rate. It goes off when it says the sensor's not connected, but it always is. The sensor doesn't move off their foot. It'll go off at least once every five seconds, middle of the night, and once it goes off, every person in the house is awake. <laughs> and you have to get up and you have to silence it for... You get to silence it for, you know, a good 10, 15 seconds, and then it does it again. A perfect example of the story, the boy who cried wolf. Not once has it been a real issue. Tonight, they are doing a test to see if Reese and Royal can get off of oxygen. Praise, please, please get off of that. Anyways, Kara, what do you rate this box out of 10? <laughs> for good or bad? I don't know, just out of a 10. 10 out of 10? 20 out of 10 for terrible. Get out of my house. <laughs> can we do a review about how beautiful you are? Yeah. You're a 10 out of 10. Next. <laughs> <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> the thing about me and Dylan is that we are crazy when we get together. Looking back at a lot of these videos on here, we'll show you guys some of them. I apologize in advance. Oh, so that dance I was doing earlier, the Pita, Pipa, Pika, Peppa, that's my boy D. He is the high stepper. Those are from other YouTubers, Dan Rue and Nick and Patty Whack. That dance, we did it everywhere. Being AMC, baby, with it, we live, baby, yeah. This my man, Dan. Dan is the man. Get, 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 in the gotcha, 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 in the, that's the one. We up in LA Fitness, baby, we live, baby, yeah. Dan, what is you doing? Oh, eat a pop a pick a pan. So, baby, we live. Dan. Man, you turn up, Peter, Papa, Pickle Pan. That over there in front of the police car, is that my man D Rock? Yeah, Peter, Papa, Pickle Pan. That's my man QT, baby, we live, baby. <laughs> D, what is you doing over there, Peter, Papa, Pickle Pepper? That's my boy D, he is the hot stepper. Is it the shoes? Man, you love it when you do your thing, baby, yeah. This is baby, we live, baby. Peter, Papa, oh! What is you doing over there? Peter, Papa, Pickle. Yeah, baby. 
We in Chipotle with the baby, we live. <laughs> My boy D-Rock could've met. D what is you doing? Peter, Papa, Pickle, Pepper, that's my boy. They got mad at me. the hot pepper. Is it the shoe? They yelled. He said, hey, get down. And I felt kind of weird because we hadn't ordered yet. So then I was like, sorry, sorry. Can I get a burrito? Brother, where are you? I'm right here, brother. What do you say we scale these mountains together, brother? Brother, what if you I can do anything? Man, look at that hair. That was me. Can you believe I had hair like that? Yeah, I wish she still did. She wants me to grow my hair out again. I love his hair when it's long and in a bun. Oh, I know. Let's let the YouTube family decide. What do you guys think? Leave in the comments below. Should I grow my hair out again or should I leave it short? Just do it for me, people. For the past, I don't know, five hours, we have been decorating our house. We have been putting up Christmas stuff. It looks really good and we can't wait to show you the chat one Christmas home. Hey, oh, that's just Kara. Yeah. Randy, are you ready? <laughs> Show us the Christmas house. If you guys made it this far without skipping, I want to know. So if you got to this point without skipping any of the video, I don't know if it's been like, what, two hours, two and a half hours, put one of these emojis in the comments. You guys are true chat fan members and honestly, I'm impressed. This is a long vlog. I'm gonna go through the comments, I'm gonna find one of these emojis and I'm gonna send you guys some free merch. I'll be looking out for you in the comments. Again, Kara, happy birthday. If you haven't wished my babe happy birthday, go into the comments and wish her happy birthday. Love you, Kara, and all that you do for her family. We hope you guys are having a good day. Stay safe out there and we will see you at the next movie. Good night, chat fam, love you guys.